after I got off the last cruise that we went on, I was weighing in at uh, about 215 pounds. And unfortunately, that was the same time I had to go in for my uh, six month annual checkup. And Dr. Boris handed me a pamphlet. It was for pre-diabetics. And he suggested that I look into the program. Today, one in three adults in America is at high risk for type two diabetes, an irreversible yet preventable disease. That 79 million people and only 10% of them even know it. Prediabetes is the condition in which individuals have blood glucose levels that are higher than normal, but not high enough to be classified as type 2 diabetes. However, this means they are at high risk for developing the disease, among other health issues, within just 10 years. For Jerry, being diagnosed with prediabetes at age 78 meant that he needed to make a change. When he told me that I was pre-diabetic, I think that uh, sort of scared me into the point that uh, I needed to do something. The YMCA's Diabetes Prevention Program is part of the CDC-led National Diabetes Prevention Program. There are two main goals of the program. One is to reduce uh, the participant's body weight by 7% and to increase physical activity to 150 minutes a week, which breaks out to about 30 minutes a day. We also go over negative thoughts that people might have when they don't necessarily see the change that they want or how to get back on track, how to deal with different social settings and cues, as well as motivation to keep going and stay positive. Through this life-changing program, lifestyle coaches work with adults in small groups across the community to help them learn the importance of exercise, nutrition, and support as a means to prevent the irreversible disease. For Jerry, the support he found in the program was just what he needed. It just seemed like no matter what I did, uh, I stayed basically uh, the same weight. Participants in the class, I think everybody in the class helped everybody else and learned what I can eat and what I can't eat. And also, probably the portion control is the uh, biggest thing. When Jerry started the program, he was over 200 pounds, um, and he has a personal goal of getting right around 170 pounds. He weighed in today at 175. You could just tell that his personal commitment to the program was above and beyond. Not only was Jerry able to change his eating habits, but he also became more active. He found that the best way to get his exercise was just by doing the things he loved to do. I have uh, several antique cars. I generally go over in the morning and spend maybe four hours, uh, sometimes five hours, which is, can be very physical because I get on top of the car, under the car, or whatever it takes. Today, Jerry is feeling better than ever. He has his blood glucose levels under control and has seen changes in his overall well-being. So I went back to the doctor uh, a couple months ago and uh, He's talking about uh, taking me off of Lipitor because my uh, cholesterol numbers are just, uh, he said they're perfect. I am no longer considered pre-diabetic and uh, he would like me to maintain my weight where it is now. You know, after going through this program that, uh, you know, I can do more of what I want to do, have less aching bones and uh, it just uh, takes away limitations that uh, you get with old age. You know, there's a program probably for everybody, and I happen to get the uh, right program the first time. Jerry is just one of many examples of how the Y is working to help people live better. With your support, we are able to provide the tools and resources for our community to prevent type 2 diabetes and live long, healthy, productive lives.